travel disruptions have been reported at Canada's busiest airport for a second day in a row. Our Shauna Hunt is at Pearson Airport today tracking developments for us. Shauna, lots of questions here. Uh, yeah, so uh, Faiza, what we know right now is that the GTAA is describing it as a non-urgent security concern. We don't know what that means, uh, exactly what that means just yet, but it did cause some big delays this morning. I do want to show you around right now, give you a look at what's going on. You can see that, you know, uh, things have significantly calmed down from just a few hours ago when large crowds uh, were here gathered waiting to get through the security line in Terminal 1. So that issue has been resolved but it has been a rough couple of mornings for people moving through the airport. Yesterday, thousands were impacted when passengers were shuffled through the wrong door and were mixed in with travelers who had already been screened. And because of that, many flights to the United States were held for some time. We did speak to one traveler who was caught up in that mess. It felt like the most disorganized, <laughs> embarrassing, <laughs> operational moment. And then I would say within about an hour and a half, there were just like the gate agents started announcing that different flights could start to board. And they opened up a couple of the doors that had been closed to really free the congestion because it was very congested in the terminal. So it appears that was a case of human error. We're being told that a ground handler with an airline uh, was behind that mistake. We don't have all the details of what went wrong here today. But again, as you can see, things are moving uh, smoothly once again. And the GTAA is encouraging travelers, as they always do, to check their flight status before heading here to the airport. Okay, thank you, Shauna. That is our Shauna Hunt at Pearson Airport.